am Isabella Jane and I am Rosie and today we are looking at a real real childhood classic um, a big memory for me Winnie the Pooh <gasps> I love Winnie the Pooh <laughs> me too so this starts on a windy windy day but before we get there once a ton of time there was Pooh Bear on a windy day and he thought today is a good time to go to my think spot and think think I want to think stop too where I can think think so he went there and it was very very windy and a beaver popped out of the ground what and he said don't you think it should go home it's Wednesday not Wednesday so Pooh Bear thought I should go tell everyone a happy Wednesday. I want to tell people happy Wednesdays. Happy Wednesday! <laughs> so he went to everyone's house. He went to Piglet's house and there Piglet was sweeping away leaves that had fallen that the wind had brought and every time he swept it away another gust of wind came and brought leaves back. And eventually, a massive gust of wind came and swept Piglet away. <gasps> what did Pooh Bear do? Well, Winnie the Pooh ran after him and followed Piglet through everyone's homes, through Rabbit's garden of carrots, which made him very angry, and eventually into Owl's house. <gasps> so Mr. Owl invited them in, and because of all the wind, Owl's house came tumbling down. <gasps> oh no! So, so what happened? Well, Eeyore thought that he would help rebuild Owl's house, so he began. And then that evening when everyone was sleeping, there was a big storm and there was water everywhere. <gasps> so all they did was they went to Christopher Robin's house and they all stayed there because it was a bit higher than where all the water could reach. However, Pooh and Piglet were missing. <gasps> Where were they? They were being thrown around by the wind. Pooh had a honey pot stuck on his head and Piglet was clinging to a chair. And do you know what? What? Pooh saved Piglet. He clung onto Piglet and they were both safe. Oh, that's very, very good. So then uh, let's get back to Owl's house. What happened there? Well... Piglet told Owl that he can go live in his little house. That's so nice of Piglet. But then, where would Piglet live? Well, that's when his best friend Pooh said, you can come live with me. <gasps> so they were living together and Pooh was so lovely to, to help Piglet. Yeah, he was. I love Winnie the Pooh. I love all the characters. Deep in the hundred acre wood Where Christopher Robin plays You'll find the enchanted neighbourhood Of Christopher's childhood days A donkey named Eeyore is his friend Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the 